Hey, it's Memorial Day weekend. So I figured I would, I would grill some steaks on the grill for Memorial Day weekend. Oh my God, it's actually fucking hailing. So, I, I. Hello, and welcome back to Overused Cooking Show Perry for Retards. I'm Chef Dragsaw, and this is different marinades that we're experimenting with our steaks. You see, Memorial Day is a time where we celebrate dead US soldiers, I think, something like that. So I figured it'd be appropriate to become one with them by committing suicide. I don't, there's not even any. each of these four bags, I will put a different experimental marinade, and then at the end, grill it, and then eat it. So the first one we're gonna do is our control. So this is just gonna marinate in the juices that God gave it. The second one, when the party starts, A1 steak sauce. You see, this this got inspired by a member of TJ, the Amazing Atheist Discord server, uh, postulating upon how it would taste if you were to marinate steak into A1 sauce. Well, we're here to Mythbusters that shit. Ah! Interference! That seems adequately enough for marination. It's so fucking potent, dude. Like, it's so overpowering. Now this next one is what's really gonna get the party going. That's, of course, Fagio Cola. So we're gonna put about 330 to 660 milliliters. And you wanna make sure that it's freshly nice and carbonated. So that way the bag will be nice and inflated when it marinates. Baguio Cola. Locked and loaded. Tastes like America. Fuck! God damn it! And the last one, of course, is the most out of the box, but I think this is what brilliant minds do. And then go wide. See, it's mouthwash. Just use the whole container of it. Tornado that shit in. It's kind of sloshed around a little bit. It smells lovely right now. Let's get a, get a taste of that first, just to spoil ourselves. It actually already tastes horrible. It actually already tastes pretty good. All right, with everything all set, we're gonna throw these in the fridge and return tomorrow the day after Memorial Day. All right, shut up. It's the next day, and we got our juicy bags out. Control the A1. Baggio. We usually have these like black 
red residue spots, and of course, the mouthwash. So we're gonna get these out and all seasoned up. No, this is a, this is actually the first normal thing I've done. All right, let's go fire up the grill. Now, some experts out there might say that you want to do these well done to be sure because this is insane. You don't want to cause germs. But a real man knows the only way to eat steak is medium rare. Make sure to throw it down the splash searing hot. Uh, residue into your face as you do it. And now, the alcohol one. We're gonna throw these on for five minutes on each side. Come back, and we'll see what happens. Alright, it's time to check up on them. See, this one looks bubbly for some strange reason, I don't know. No, control is looking like a control. A one thing okay. And the mouthwash one is like you could swear it was like an actual freaking thing. I just realized that I put I put all that seasoning on it to sear it. But we're doing it on a grill. Oh my god. The soda one has really gotten interesting. Take a look at this side here. I don't know if that is soda or what is it. But I think it's time to enjoy these bad boys. Hard earned American made meal. You know, join me. Oh boy. Alright. Oh boy! <laughs> Fuck you! It's time to enjoy this delicious hard-earned meal. I'm gonna cut this into the tiniest bite size my body will allow. And of course. It smells of alcohol. <clears throat> I can still smell it. Now, of course, I fucked it up. It's only a $10 steak, but I cooked it well done. Idiot! <clears throat> See how the control tastes. Like salt, because it didn't sear. And I got fucking salt directly into my eye doing that. And that's not a bit or a joke, I actually did. And it's drying my eye out like hell. So the control so far is the worst. Is it really? This is very salty because it didn't sear. These parts look like they actually seared here on the A1. Okay, it's salty, but it could be worse. That actually, if you taste it with the sear, some of it actually successfully seared. So this is the cola ones, the first more unconventional one. And it appears to have these spider eggs kind of on it. They kind of disappear, but they're still on there. These like little nodules of white. So I got one with a good amount of sear. Um, let's give it a, give it a taste. Try it. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? That's not the worst thing in the world. Yes, I would recommend That it. is definitely a steak. Hey, Hell's Kitchen, when you start copying this shit, we're gonna recognize it. Colas, Colas oh, fucking that. marinated steaks, that's our idea. Alright. And now it's time for business here. Alcohol is the most American thing you can do, as far as I'm concerned. Number one leading cause of death in America is uh, auto accident. De uh, drunk driving is probably a factor in that.
Oh god, this works. It's so acutely menthol-y and smoky. Oh! It gets worse as you chew it. You want to have another one? Like the flavors unlock, kind of. Now, you don't taste a lot of alcohol. I suspect the alcohol burned out. But what's there packs a fucking punch. Have another bite. I'm okay. You have, you have a bite. I don't want to be greedy. You have a bite. Oh, no. Uh-oh! All right. Give the same size bite. That's. It's about the same size, right? Yeah, that's perfect. Exactly the same size. Right. Is it actually? Are it's you fucking with it's me? It's a little big. It's a little big. Solid mouthwash. Does it kill me? Uh, I don't know. I didn't. I didn't look at any nutritional facts or do any research at all. Why? Cause it's a bit. All right. <clears throat> well, I'm ex excited to throw these uh, forty dollars steaks directly oh, into the trash. Too. I'm not even sure about those. Those ones. All right. Thanks for watching.